I want everyone to know why you feel that 2A, passing 2A is so important for Pueblo's energy future. 2A is really a pretty simple question. Do we want to terminate the franchise agreement with Black Hills Energy uh, 10 years early and establish a municipal power authority under the auspices of the water board? Now, the language is complicated because it was written by lawyers, uh, but it, it's a pretty simple issue. Uh, based on the studies that I have seen and the research I've done and the experts that I've talked with, the Board of Waterworks, uh, moving to a municipal utility is in the best long-term interest of this community because we will control our destiny. We won't be at the beck and call of this investor-owned utility or any other investor-owned utility that they might decide to sell to. We'll control our power locally. Uh, and we'll have so much more control than we have right now with this independently elected water board. Every two years, at least one member of the Board of Waterworks is up for election. Some years, uh, two. Um, th last year, three members of the Board of Waterworks were on the ballot for election. So a majority on, of the board was on the board for election. We never get to vote for the board of directors of Black Hills Energy or for the members of the Public Utility Commission. Right now, those are the people that are setting our rates, and we have no voice in that whatsoever. So. I've become convinced that in the long run, a municipal owned utility would be the best way to go for this community's future. 